Hey, I'm Katie, and this is Katie Play Stuff, where I play stuff for you. And today, we're getting to the next part of Beyond Two Souls. All right, guys, so as you remember last time, we had our first date. I want to say it's our first date, um, which didn't end up going so well because I didn't end up losing my virginity like I thought I would. <laughs> so pretty much because of choices that I made earlier in the game, which is kind of crazy. I feel like everyone who plays this game for the first time is going to have the same outcome because honestly, my first time playing, um, that chapter where you take control of Cole's body and you go to the bar and you like almost get raped by the guys at the bar, I feel like a lot of people would have done the exact same thing that I did because who's just going to choose to stay and completely skip the chapter? So I guess you could have just not gone completely, um, didn't choose to be cold, didn't go to the bar. But I think you also could have chosen to leave the bar instead of playing pool like I did. Um, you could have chose to leave when you realized that your friends weren't coming. Um, so that sucks. So all of that, all the choices I made in like episode two, literally, it was so long ago, um, affected me when I was trying to get in the sack uh, during my date, which, you know, is fine. Sex isn't everything. You don't need to have sex on your date, but it kind of just sucks because, you know, it didn't go so well. <laughs> anyway, let's get on with the next part. All right, night session, right after the experiment. So we are a little kid again. Let's see what we can do. Just wanna look around. So we're watching cartoons. This must be all the uh, data that they're getting. Hanging out on the computers. Let's see, can I mess with anything? Can I do anything? What's in here? What's that? Can't even see what it is. Oh wait, wait, wait. Unlocked a new bonus, hell yeah! All right, I can't get too much further. Well, that's good. I bet there's so many things I've missed. Oops. Nope. Let's get back up. So, why are we having a night session in here? What does that even mean? Nathan, I'm so tired. Can we go now? Oh, jeez. Is that what time it is? I'm sorry. I, I just realized my camera. Hold on. I just realized my camera's in the wrong spot. Normally I put it over here. <laughs> All right, let's get back. I know you've had a long day. Hey, this morning I bought your book. What do you say we get you tucked in and I read to you? Yes, please. <laughs> I must have left it in the other room. Why don't you go in there and get it? I'll finish up here and then we can go. Okay? Sure, I'm on it. <laughs> it's so cute because I think he lost his daughter, Laura, um, because I think in the last video you kind of noticed that. Uh, so it's almost like he thinks of her as a daughter now and it's really cute. Uh-oh. So, where did he leave that book? Why don't you just tell us? Let's see... Stop it, Aiden. It's not funny. No, it's not. We all know what happens. Oh wait, here it is. Aiden? Are you doing that, Aiden? I don't think Aiden's doing that. One, two, three, door closes. Ah! 
What? Who the heck is that? Who were those people? They looked a little familiar, but I might just be crazy. Okay. I'm ready. Ah, you found it. Now we can get down to the serious business of bedtime stories. <laughs> Jody. Jody, you okay? You look pale. She looks dead tired is how she looks. Come on, Nathan, let's get her off to bed. This is probably when she first starts seeing ghosts. Yes. Yes, hold on. Nathan, it's for you. Nathan Dawkins. Oh no, that's his family. This is how his daughter dies. Nathan? Nathan, what's up? My wife. Daughter, they were coming back from my mother's. Truck. Drunk driver. Wrong side of the road. Dead. Um, Jody, let's get you off to bed. Hey, just stay right here. I'll be right back. Come on, Jody. I was just talking about his daughter, and oh my god. That's so sad. I'm gonna tear up. I think my eyes are just irritated from my eye makeup though. Whew, the mission. Oh, that's so sad. Jamal Sheikh Sharif, one of the most dangerous warlords in the country. He commands a heavily armed militia, using it to control several important districts in the city, which means none of our humanitarian aid is getting through. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. Now, he relocates twice a day. Last time we pinpointed him was at the Zanaki Hotel, which is right here. Not much of a chance he's still there, but it's as good a place as any to start looking. You'll be on your own this mission. No direct engagement with the enemy, no backup. You identify and eliminate your target, then activate your GPS beacon so we can extract you. We need to get you out before sunrise, so don't waste any time. The last American soldier that was captured here was pulled through the city behind a jeep. They found his head, one of his legs, in a fishing boat. I wouldn't recommend it. So why do I have to do this by myself? I'll be back before they even realize what's happened. Watch yourself out there, Jody. I don't want anything to happen to you. We still have time before I go, right? Time for what? Are we doing it now? So wait, I wasn't looking at the timeline because I was so upset about his daughter and his wife dying, but um, so is this after the date or is this before the date? I'm gonna say it's after because she's a little less awkward, but I wasn't paying attention so I couldn't tell you. Anyway, why do I care so much? Good luck, Jody. Thanks. 
Okay, bye. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. At least I'm not completely alone. Got Katie and Aiden over here. One of them is worthless. That would be me. Ooh. No direct engagement with the enemy. No backup. Check that there are no soldiers around, Aiden. Oops. This is gonna be fun! Awesome. Oop. See some people right over here. Yeah, get the fuck out. Uh, who else? I don't see anybody except for this guy. Oh. <laughs> Alright, I'm doing it, I'm doing it. Oh, I see, so what I have to do is get close. And make him move. But I don't remember how to freaking do this. It's been so long since we were sneaking around. Alright, well, we could have did it a better way if I actually knew what I was doing, but... Oh well. Alright, I think we're okay. Just check around this corner if I can. Alright. Oops, go, go, go. I think we're good. see anybody. Do I? Just a hanging guy. Alright, not bad. Am I supposed to jump down though? Yep. Last time we pinpointed him was at the Zanaki Hotel, which is right here. See if you find anything. Zanaki Hotel? Great, great. Now let's go. let's go. Okay, that's the hotel. What is this? Oh, okay. Bonus. Got it. Alright, how am I- Ah! How am I gonna get up there? So dangerous that I'm doing this by myself. I can't even talk. All right, there's guys over here. Can't get close enough. 
we're gonna have to... Oh wait, there's a person over here too, shit. Now what? Should I go for it? It's a bad idea. I can't do anything to him, so just keep going. Shit. Oh wait, I could probably jump over at him. There we go. Alright, we doing this, we doing this! I feel like I'm in like, The Last of Us again. What is going on? Are those my guys? Nope, probably not. Get rid of them. <laughs> For a second, I thought that he was gonna kill uh, the civilian. All right, let's go. This way, this way. All right. Now what? Can't go that way. Can I? Can I just go? Okay, here we go. Gotta get into the hotel. God, the, the controls, I swear, are so wonky. This could be so much easier to maneuver. I'm sure there's a way to get through this whole level without killing anybody. But, uh, we're not good like that. The Zanaki Hotel. Found it. Go. Go, bitch, go. Probably could have just walked up the stairs without killing him, but you know. We've already come this far. Alright, can we go upstairs now? Let's just see if there's anybody up here. Oop, too far, too far. There we go. What's that? Think we're good? They've gone.
they gone. What else? There's more stuff. This way, this way, this way, this way. Oops. There's one not far from here. Should be easy to find. All right, that's where we'll go. Uh, here. There's a guy right there. Oh, there's tons of guys over here. Shit. Alright, what's the plan? As if those guys did not see that, are you kidding me? <laughs> Are they oblivious? <laughs> okay, up. Wait. Ah! I probably could have went up behind him and got him. Let's go this way. Oh! I'm scared. There's a guy over here. I like don't have anything to say right now, guys. I'm sorry. I'm stressed. I think we're doing okay, though. I think so. Okay. Okay. Wait. Am I going the wrong way? I don't know. This way, I think. There's this cathedral? I don't know. Where am I going? There. <laughs> okay. Go for it. As if. Okay, 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 we're good. We good. Now which way we going? way we're going? I can't freaking tell because I can't see. I guess so. Hmm. What to do? What to do? Stay in the shadows. Okay. Thought they saw me for a second. Alright, I'm not supposed to go that way. Apparently I'm supposed to go this way.
لا توجد كلمة أخرى تقال غير كلمة أخرى أحجبنا أجمعين Away. <laughs> All right, we're making progress. Oh, there's guys right there. <laughs> Just you know, excuse me. Let me see if I can scare them off. Nope. Just make myself known, I guess. Is this the cathedral? Am I trying to get in here? Hello? Can you help me? Is this a door? No? Hello? <laughs> okay, yeah, I guess so. So now what? Save him! It won't let me! I'm not close enough! I didn't save him. I bet there's actually a chance that you can save everybody if I just hurried the fuck up. Ooh, come back. Come back. Wait! Oh, now I can't click on him, really? Sorry. I hate the controls on this stupid thing. Uh, now what? Where am I going? Here we go. Should have saved those people. I feel bad. All right, let's keep moving. Uh, oh my god, my nose is so itchy. I don't know why. I don't even know where I'm going either. I'm just going. Just doing what I gotta do. Ooh. You just shooting at dead people now? The cathedral. The cathedral. From where did I see it in my vision? They came here. Oh, did they? Let's see. We've got something right in front of us. matter how this got tipped over? Like, do I care that much? Can't do this. Someone almost 
did the job for me. Alright, let's go. Go, bitch, go! Okay. We want to go there. Can I go through the cathedral though? Think we're good? I don't see anybody in here. Alright. Alright, what's going on down here? Here, people. Hmm. Oh. Oh. I, I just want to help you. He doesn't speak English. Towards you. Don't don't shoot me, okay? Oh, he does speak English. He's lost a lot of blood. He's gonna die if I don't help him. Poor little boy. Sorry, I, I, I don't understand a word you're saying. Salim, Salim, Salim. Your name is Salim. Salim. I love you, Salim. I'm jo Jody. Jody? Yeah, yeah, Jody. Jody, Jody. Oh, this little kid is breaking my heart. I need you now. What do you need? What do you need? Where am I going? There we go. Over here? Alright, I've gotta get closer. Alright. Uh, okay. Let me... let me try. Okay, that's not gonna work. Um... Alright, so... I gotta get this guy over here. Oh my god, that little kid. This... This guy. Gotcha, bitch. You touch Salim, I touch you. Whatever that means. All right, let's go. All right, can I get him now? Get 
out of here before more show up. <laughs> Save me, Salim! Oh. Okay, I'm supposed to back up. Supposed to back up. Supposed to back up. Right, right, down. And up. Oh, I don't know which way I'm actually going. Aiden, where are you? That could have been bad. Are you okay? Are you okay? I think. It's okay. I'm all right. We make a damn good team, don't we, Salim? Now it's daytime? The sun is rising. It's gonna make it tough to not be seen now. The tower. The tower's over there. That's where I need to go. I know where it is! Follow me! I can get you there! What have I got to lose? Where he's like, come on, little bitch, you're taking too long! Oh shit. Salim is better than me. Go, 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 Jody, go! Oh my god, I'm so sick of you not moving! Run! Know what I'm doing? That's what I'm doing. Hell yeah! You're like magic or something, bitch. We're almost there. Still so far away. Ooh. So, my understanding is they're in a war against each other. So, why am I here? Damn, kid. You got some skills, little Spider Man. Spider Salim. There it is. 
Get rid of him. Oh, it'll be my pleasure. Uh oh, this is gonna get brutal. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have some KFC for dinner. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> he doesn't even know. Alright. Oh, maybe I can get in the truck on the side. Nah, I can't walk that way. Hey, man. That sucks. Well, if we get in back, oh, he's gonna drive us, yeah. That's right. Take it slow, Eddie. We try to get by without being noticed. Well, I'm not actually driving, so I guess, do I just chill like this for a while? Okay. Hopefully we're almost there. I feel like this tower's getting further and further away. This is so scary. Ooh. Uh-oh. Roadblock. I'm tired. That was pretty crazy shit. This is where we have to go our separate ways. I must go. Do you understand, Salim? You can't go. You can't do this on your own. You need me. I'm sorry, but you can't come with me. You're really brave, Salim. Someday, this is all gonna be over. And you can just go back to being a kid. I'll never forget you, magic bitch. I love him so much. Why couldn't he stay with us? Jamal was around here somewhere. I don't have much time. I love him so much. See, now I feel like crying again. <sighs> I'm overly emotional today. All right, where am I going? Towards the tower. Goodbye, my little friend. Farewell. I hate the controls. All right, all right. Ooh, there's a guy right here. Don't 
I'm stuck. I can't touch him, so. Let's see what I can do. Now find a place close to the house where I can take cover. Looks good. You know what you have to do. Find your mom, I didn't. That's him. That's your mom. I won't be able to get close enough. You're gonna have to do it. I gotta keep a little bit Okay. Uh, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? What is what's up here? Hold still. Shit. What's he doing? Wait, I can't even see him. I can't see him. Is that Salim? I can't fucking see. This is so hard. Salim, what are you doing in here? You're playing at a time like this? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Oh wait, is this one of those stupid things? Yeah, okay. Anyway. What do I do? What do I do? Uh... This guy. That'll work. How did Slim even get up there? Was this like his dad or something? Why can I go in? They're having a meeting. Alright, I gotta be him again. Nope, I can't. Gotta find another way. I'm gonna be sick from these controls. Can't be you. What am I doing? It'll come to me at some point. I just gotta figure it out. What's this? He's gone. He doesn't know. This guy. Good. Now find a weapon. Find a weapon. What about the truck with the gun on the back? To do it. Orders are orders. The guy's got blood on his hands. He deserves to die. Come on. I can do this. You can do I this. can kill him. I can kill him. You can do this. I can do this. Right? I can do this. Jody, 
We can do this. We killed the guys at the bar. Is that him? I can't try and help. It's terrible. Fuck. Fuck, we gotta get out of here. Holy shit! Oh, man. Okay, go, 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 go! Jesus! Oh, I gotta be out of I can't do this, it's so hard! Alright, what can I do for you? Nothing? Oh, shit. Am I okay? I was helping you. Jody, we have to move. Oh, okay. Jody! Get you out of here. 
horrible. Thought Salim was my friend. But I killed his dad. Ten years in the CIA. Never seen anything like it. Boss sends his own private helicopter to get Major back. All the top brass are crazy about you, Jody. You and Aiden, of course. Jody, you okay? Listen, I know this one was tough, but it's over. I'm going home. Just another mission accomplished, right? I'll never forget what I saw back there, right? Never. How's your leg? Better when this painkiller kicks in. And the international community had just announced its official recognition of the election of the new president, Jamal Sheikh Sharif. Jamal Sheikh Sharif, one of the most dangerous warlords in the country. And now, Sources report that he and all his government were assassinated in what appears to be an unclaimed attack. We have to find Jamal and eliminate him. Hopes were high that the newly recognized President Jamal Sharif would be able to put an end to the hostilities that have ravaged his country for many years. A number of world leaders have already expressed outrage at what appears to be nothing less than a cold-blooded execution. We have to find Jamal and eliminate him. You lied to me. What are you talking about? Jamal wasn't a warlord. He was the president. He was the democratically elected president. Your point? We're not politicians, we had our orders. You knew I wouldn't have murdered him. So you lied to me. Welcome to the CIA, Jody. It's not fucking choir practice in case you haven't noticed. Now we had a job to do and we did it. End of story. This might just be a fucking job to you, okay? But I don't go around killing people because some four fucking star general tells me to. What's going on? Listen, you calm down, all right? We'll get back home and we'll talk about it, okay? You manipulated me. You used me to do your dirty work. What difference does it make? Jody, you was a dead man walking with or without you. I have blood on my hands. Some kid lost his father because of me. Because I trusted you. Because I trusted him. We were doing the right thing. What am I, you, Ryan? A toy? Some fucking puppet that you can just do whatever you want with? We're getting massive turbulence. What? I can't control it. Did you also lie to me that night in my apartment? Jody, for God's sake, you're gonna kill us. No one's ever gonna lie to me again, Ryan. Jody! Fuck! Fuck! <laughs> Only Jody would jump out of a helicopter.
Okay. I kissed Ryan. I avoided capture, which is good. Apparently you can get captured. I took weapon from the soldier. Uh, rescued on the roof. Sp Apparently you couldn't get rescued on the roof? That's weird. Uh, spotted in the town. Passed the checkpoint. Didn't attempt suicide. Jeez. All right, guys. Well, we have to stop this one here. Gosh, that was such a heart-wrenching episode because I love Salim and I feel so bad for him that his father is dead. And that guy was trying to stop all of the wars, which he wasn't doing a great job, but the president, he was trying to stop all the wars that were happening in his country. And we just went and killed him. And, like, I understand that it was our job. I mean, like, even if I said no, like... Would they have made me do it anyway? You know? I don't know. Whew, that was just nuts. And I don't know how I feel about Ryan anymore. I, I don't know how I really felt about him to begin with. I guess I always thought he was a big douchebag. So that's that. Like, there's part of me that likes him because I feel like he does care about Jody. But there's part of me that, like, you know, he's a fucking dickhead. Anyway. <laughs> <sighs> well, we'll get back into the next one pretty soon, but I have to end this one here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs>